Hello everybody, Alex here from Snake on Exotics and today we've got delivery day and I think we've got an animal delivery. Whoa, it's only a little tiny one, it's only one animal, but we've still got an animal delivery. Because we've had so much boarding, so many rescues, I haven't been able to do many animal orders and there hasn't been much money about either. So, um, I didn't want to fill the shop with animals and then have more rescues come in and not be able to house them and not be able to house the holiday animals as well. So we are coming towards the end of the holidays now and the rescues have calmed down a little bit. So fingers crossed it will start teetling out and we can work out what tanks we got and we can do bigger animal orders. But I've got one here now, so we can have a butcher, so please let's go comment share ring the bell for me. Let's crack on with the day. Waha. Okay then everybody, animal unboxing. How from fire back to got the stuff ready to open it, wouldn't it really? Come on. I wasn't thinking, I didn't get prepared. I didn't get prepared. I don't know. Too excited to get the animal out. Too excited. We had a customer, well, we had a local saying hello back, I think. No, he was a customer the other day, though. He was, he bought some fishies. Ooh. Oh, wow. Hello. Oh, and the phone. Popular man this morning, popular man this morning. Ooh. Wow. Hypo Beardy Dragon. And she's a good size. Wow. I'm happy with that. Hypo bearded dragon. That's brilliant, that is. That's a customer order, but they're not having it till like the end of the month. So she can have a good length of time here with us, have quarantine, get all comfortable, make sure she's doing everything she should. So we should be really, really good by the time they come and collect it. I've also got the tank and everything already here. All we gotta do when it gets closer to the day, we build it all and uh, they can come collect it, then after the next couple of days, they can come get the animal. Wah! So we've got to set him up in the tank, um, and then we'll do the rest of the delivery. Putting him in this tank up here, we've just got to set it up for him. So we're going to put you in there like this. Oh, move. There we go. So we're going to tissue it out, because we don't put them on a substrate at the moment, because we need to make sure they're doing everything they should. So we put all the tissue down. Once we put all the decor in there, it uh, will make it look a lot nice, a lot flatter and easier for the tissue. So we do that there like that. And then I'm gonna put another row at the back. I might have to move you a little bit just while I do it. Like that, just a sec. Do -do 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 -do. Putting the tissue in. Come on, probe on top, tissue down. Okay, put you back. There we go, lovely job. So we need, we've got a fake plant that we're gonna be putting in. Like so. Then we've got the wall, cold end, her little hide, like that. There we go. Oh, drop the keys. A little bit of cork bark for decor, water bowl, and then right where you are, we're gonna have another hide. Just like that. There we go with the probe on top, so we know the temperature of the basking spot is perfect. So there we go. Lovely little setup for him, just for while he's in his quarantine. We have got to put some water in his bowl, and we may get a mealworm bowl. Well, it depends if he's eating mealworms or locusts or whatever he prefers. So we jump on, uh, we'll go get him now and we'll put him in his tank. A little look before we put him in the tank. Hey buddy. Hey. Are you nice and tame? Are you naughty? Hey. Woo! 
Hey, the little wiggle bum. Hey, the little wiggle bums. We've got to be careful. Well, there's the patterns. Look at that. So he's a hypo. Very, very nice. He should be nice and light colours with some oranges and yellows on him and stuff like that. Really, really nice. He's just coming into shed. As you can see, his tail is a lot paler. So that will then come up his body and then his tail may start shedding first or it may come up in little bits and start shedding but uh, he is in the middle of starting to shed so I think we're doing really well he looks great he's bright eyed he's bushy tailed so um, yeah I'm happy we've got all our fingers all our toes so let's put him in the tank go little buddy you sit and chill there and we'll get you some water Lovely job. And then we'll leave you to settle for a bit and we'll feed you after I've done the unboxings. All the live food away, I have sold a lot of it already and they never sent me any large, so I'm missing the large. Uh, I put the frozen away and I've opened the box of live fish food because uh, I had customers wanting it. Um, so now we've got these three boxes down here to open and this bag out. Let's dive in and see what we've got in the boxes there. Come on, tape. Get out of it. Ooh. We got bulbs. Lovely job. 100 watt screw bulbs. Great for all our basking needs. It's literally it's all bulbs. So, put that one down. Oh, oh, oh. What's in this one? Got some lovely more bulbs in there. I've just seen the delivery note. Looks like they've sent me 22 bulbs and I didn't order 22 bulbs. I think this is another pack of bulbs. Oh well, another solid pack of bulbs. I don't know why they've done that, but oh well, we'll get it sorted. Last one, I've already pre-opened it because we learnt our lesson when we sliced our finger open. Mmm, different, different, not like we usually get. Not like what we usually get. That's more of a twiggy than a branchy. Okay, I didn't want that, I didn't want it, that's, I didn't want it. <laughs> so that's a bit different to what we usually get. Mmm. What else we got? In the bag. I'm reaching in, reaching in, reaching in. Got a branch. See, that's more branchy. But it is pretty small. We've got a couple more, a couple more. I'm going in. We're going in. We're going in. We're going in. Ooh. These ones aren't so bad. These are more what we're looking for. Ah, they're better. Yeah, that's better. Lovely. So I get all them labelled up. We get them put out. I have got to feed the axolotls. We've got some lovely little blood worm ready to go. Um, and then we're going to feed the new arrival. She's been up there chilling. I'll give you a little sneak peek. It's been a couple of hours. Oh, there's been a big gap between me opening those boxes and me doing that bag. So I've had customers and I had to shoot off because Laura locked her safe hint. So, <laughs> well, the, we need new door locks on the back so the door kind of sticks. So she got stuck outside. So I had to quickly run home and let her in. Um, but here he is. Ooh, looking snazzy. So there we go, we'll be back in a bit to give him a feed. Well, it's almost the end of the day. Let's feed our new little dragon. You already left me a poo. You had a poo in your food. You went in your food, in your uh, box when you came. Oh, he must be feeling better after two big poos like that. We'll have to get that out. I'll feed him first. Let's see how well he does. Okay, there's one. Let's open this side up. 
Hey, buddy. Ooh. Sis. Let me give you a go. Yummy locust. Look. No? Oh, you're going to get it for that one? <laughs> okay. Let me let more out. Oh, you're going. Oh, I got it. She got it. Wee. Did you jump out? Good girl. Oh, boy. Wow, done. Cool, that poo stinks. Cool. It does. I'm going to have to get you some veg as well. Do you a veggie bowl. Whoop. Oh, you seen it? You seen that one, but it got away. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, there it is. Good. Look at that. Feed it on the first day. Couldn't be better. So I'm going to put, she's had three. So we're going to put, there's one already bobbing around. Oh, she's going for it already, I think. Yeah, she's got it. We put another one in. That's five. That's plenty for today. And uh, is that? Oh, it's, it's nice and dry. We can put that in there and throw it away. Lovely job. Well done, my lovely. Well done. Well, there you go, everybody. That's everything all done for the day. So please like, subscribe, comment, share, ring the bell for me. If you want to watch another video, there should be one there. If you want to subscribe to the channel, it's up there. If you want to watch the playlist, it's up there. If you want to support the channel, there's links in the description below where you can join the tribe, be part of the YouTube, or you can get yourself some Snake Island merch. So, uh, see you in the future. Bye.